On Christmas, the Pope asked Christians to grow closer to God in order to be more virtuous. He started his preaching in Grecho, where St. Francis had begun the Nativity scene tradition. While there, he recommended contemplating the scene of Christ's birth. He expressed his suggestions in his document, Admirabile Signum. In questo segno semplice e mirabile del presepe, che la pietà popolare ha accolto e trasmesso di generazione in generazione, viene manifestato il grande mistero della nostra fede. On Christmas Eve, he imparted his second teaching, reminding Christians that God loves people even when they fail. Puoi avere idee sbagliate, puoi averne combinate di tutti i colori, ma il Signore non rinuncia a volerti bene. Quante volte pensiamo che Dio è buono se noi siamo buoni e che ci castiga se noi siamo cattivi? Non è così. The third message was delivered on the Feast of the Epiphany. The Pope said if God loves unconditionally, then people are called to love Him in the same way by worshipping Him. He said this is the recipe against selfishness and a thirst for power, fame, and pleasure. E la vita per disintossicarsi di tante cose inutili, da dipendenze che anestetizzano il cuore e intontiscono la mente. At the end of the Christmas season, the Pope warned especially against these addictions. He said sins can be forgiven, but a corrupt person is hard to change.